I've done a few vlogs now, targeting mullet. Good morning. I've had reasonably good success using a baited spinner down at Christchurch, but for some reason I just cannot seem to catch them on float fish bread. And what I'm really after is a thick lip mullet. So in this video, um, I have a quick dabble for bass, fail, and um, try and remove that curse that seems to be hanging over me at the moment. Uh, using the, um, the shallow feed surface lure that dives only down to about five inches which is great so it cuts below the chop on the surface but it doesn't dive so deep that it's going to get snagged up in all the rocks and uh, weed that's down there set up i'm just using a 12 pound fluoro leader fg knot tied to, to um, 15 pound braid i'm using a i think it's a, a 25 gram abbey veritas rod six foot that's the one i use on the kayak nice and short um there and that's matched up with a an old Mitchell Mag, Mitchell Mag Premium. That's absolutely caked. Some big waves coming in as well. And that's what's happening on every retrieve. So can't complain about the scenery though. I've moved to the left and my lure's coming back without weed on it, which is good. Um, but I've been plugging one out for half an hour and still not had a touch. I think it might just be a bit too coloured up. Got me. I need to come up with a plan B. How are you getting on, Will? Well, I've had two little thick lip mullets, or salmon and corn, ocean going fat lips. Nothing big, but it's nice to get some bites, which I just missed because I turned the camera. Much more interesting, I think I'll join you. It's frustrating. Now that bites. <laughs> this is what happened last, last time I came here, and Sam said just shut off about a mullet's head, about a mullet's head as well. And I did that, and the float just sat there like a lift method, it just came right out of the water and I into it. I have got that my mullet um, curse still hanging over me. Go on. This is my mullet. fourth float fishing cool, session for mullet. So yeah. far, I've failed to catch every time. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh no, I didn't, didn't even prick it. I thought it was weird. That's crazy. Oh, and you might be... Yeah, you're right. Sorry. So do you hit them when they bob or do you hit them when they No, um, the fits seem to tow it. They bob, bob and tow. That's just ridiculous. Oh. <laughs> that's, a, that. that's the most positive bite I've had so far. Oh, what size was you on? 12. Stay up. Lift. Not mine. Mine. Oh, dip, yeah, dip. Go on. The, the, the tricky thing is, is any of them could be a three pound mullet. That's the Sorry. frustrating thing. Yeah, oh, oh, oh. oh, he is in as well, are you? <laughs> Bugger. <laughs> oh, and a bite oh. as well. It shows your lips. It's not hooked properly. Oh no, you're kidding. How'd you feel? Pretty gutted, there's no way I can get that. I just can't even see it now. It's gone through, it's wiggled through all the gabby on rocks. <sighs> Just keep it in the bloody net. So I should get angry. Oh yeah. That's a sea trout net. Oh, yeah. I mean, well done, not you bugger. <laughs> I love it, it's brilliant, isn't it? it? You know, it could be like two or three pounds down there. No, it's somewhere. when to strike, isn't it? When to strike. It's bobbing all over the shop, it's not going under. Oh, I had it on for a bit. Ah, oh, it didn't strike far enough. Oh, I don't know. Oh, that's better. Are you bastards. Oh, <laughs> um, Otherwise. Oh, how, how did I miss that? <laughs> they'll, tell, they'll tell you when they want to be caught. I just don't get it. Don't get it. Have you tried showing up? No. <laughs> that canoeist might have just um, spooked them there. Yes, I'm in. Oh. Last. That just really sums up my mullet fishing. Was that I really thought it was a good fish as well. It was a bend in the world. 
going to fall off in a second. Beautiful mallet. Foul hooked in the tail. It's not really how I hope to get off the mark. <laughs> oh well. That's how I'm putting the bread on the, the hook. And the point is just about showing. Bites have stopped. Have they? Yeah. Suddenly they've gone. In Hotest. Yep. That is crazy, isn't it? Maybe the sun's just got up too high. And that was that. The bites dried up. We had a stand-up paddleboard class of about 10 in front of us and people jumping off the bridge. So it's time to call it a day and find Sam over at Weymouth. So, uh, Charlie came to join me to sail up in Weymouth and he thought he'd have a dangle. And uh, that's what happens with mullet fishing. Do you think we'll get another chance? I don't know. Well, I did get another chance. Uh, I hooked a fish. That took about 50 yards of line off my reel before... Uh, shedding the hook it was a beast and it's wet my appetite for more so i will be doing a little bit more mullet fishing but in the meantime the curse continues thanks for watching and uh, yeah if you enjoy the vids please subscribe